It's an old dream that's been around for centuries, being able to see through walls. Now a team at the University of Utah has created a stir with an invention that does exactly that. It can look through walls and monitor people moving around inside a house. John Hollenhorst joins us with the details. Well, the researchers' videos on YouTube have suddenly been noticed. In the last few days, they've been written up on technology websites from MIT to the United Kingdom. It's not really like Superman's X-ray vision. It's more like Batman technology. When the Dark Knight battled terrorists holding hostages inside an office building, he got some help from technology that revealed where everybody was. That's Hollywood, but University of Utah researchers are developing a smaller scale, more realistic system that actually could help cops in hostage situations. What it does allow you to do is uh, see through walls. That could save lives. It could save law enforcement lives. They surrounded a Salt Lake City house with 34 electronic transceivers. They create a blanket of radio waves that penetrate the walls of the house. When a person walks around, he partially blocks the radio waves. A computer uses the signal fluctuations to calculate his position. He's the X moving around in the rectangular display. The researchers hope to improve the radios so they can automatically map their own locations in seconds. And that way a law enforcement agency could possibly uh, take a bunch of these devices out of their pockets and just throw them at the house. The imagery is crude because the resolution is poor. It would be hard to distinguish a person from a floor lamp unless he moves. But in a security system, for example, it could detect unauthorized intruders. You know, this system may be, may be able to cover an entire floor plan and locate people. And perhaps it could be used for senior citizens who need monitoring. So this may provide either their children or their caretakers a way to, to keep track of them without invading their privacy. It is not possible to see somebody's face. Um, it is not possible to personally identify somebody. Um, so in that sense, it's uh, more private than if I had a video camera in your house. The inventors will share any profits with the University of Utah. PhD student Joey Wilson has already set up a startup company. He believes it will be far simpler and vastly cheaper than radar systems used for similar purposes by the military. Thanks, John. Very interesting. Very interesting. <laughs>